presence of one thing is the absence of another. But the presence of joy. No, let me use it the other way around. Mm -hmm. The presence of anger is the absence of peace. Yeah. That the presence of lust mm -hmm. and all of these things, mm -hmm. they show you that you are in disadvantage yeah. in a certain way. Mm -hmm. And you see, we have to agree that as sometimes the flesh wants to find expression, mm -hmm. even when you're born again, mm -hmm. that your flesh wants to find expression. Mm -hmm. That's why Paul says, I will beat my body and bring it to subjection. Mm -hmm. So you have a lot to do. Yeah. But what are the main three things? Yeah. Pray. Amen. Fast. Amen. And read the word meditate and meditate upon it. Look at that word with the intention. The entirety of God's word is true. Amen. There is nothing about the word that is faulty. Yeah. There is nothing about the word of God that is weak. Yeah. Whatever it says, it will accomplish. It will do. The Bible says that it is forever settled. Amen. The word is forever settled. We, we don't need to twist Mr. the word and, yeah, and, and exactly. bring at the, this perspective to show you how uh, it is settled. Amen. It is settled. Amen. That's why if you read most things in the New Testament, mm. it does not say you will. Mm. It says, says pray without ceasing. Mm. Pray without ceasing. And in Ephesians chapter 6 as well, it brings out prayer mm. as one of the... Uh, uh, of the armor yeah. that you when when it gives the, the whole of the, yeah. the aspect of prayer yeah. because you can cover yourself but without prayer mm. it is very hard sure. but because prayer connects you with God mm. prayer allows you to communicate mm. with God you enhance your fellowship mm. because remember you're in a relationship, a relationship. you enhance your fellowship mm. through prayer mm. that through prayer you're able to hear things in the spirit mm. that's why when, when, when Paul is writing to this uh, Ephesians, Galatians, uh -huh. he says, since the day I had of you, I did not cease, to, I don't cease to make mention of you in my prayer. Yeah. You see? And what does he pray mostly yeah. about? And he says that, uh, uh, and especially if, if, if I would take the book of Ephesians chapter 1, and I, I think around verse 17, okay. and, 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 and he says that the eyes of your understanding may be open. The first assurance yeah. is that we are on God's side. Amen. Just imagine a man who cannot lie to you. Mm. That if he says, I will accomplish to you, he will do it. Mm. The other thing is that when we get born again, it is an assurance mm. that there is life beyond the wisdom. Mm. You see, when this tent, mm. uh, the it's Bible gone. says that when <laughs> this tent is gone, mm. there is a body. Mm. There is a being. Mm. That's why I think in the book of First Peter, the Bible says that we are, we are, we are, we, we are being built together. Mm. We are living stones mm. that are being built together in one spiritual mm. And so it it it's it it it's, our our salvation is, is is not to help us maneuver the things of this life. Mm. I think First Corinthians fifteen nineteen the Bible says that if you have hope in Christ mm. only for this life, you are above with all men supposed to be pitied. Mm. But if you can't you can't have hope in Christ just for the things of this life. Exactly. It should be beyond. Yeah. He helps you think beyond the things of this life. True. He helps you see uh, beyond the things of this mm. life. So the assurance we have, number one, is eternal life. Amen. Secondly, mm -hmm. the blessing of Abraham when we come to him. Why? Because the Bible says that Romans 11, 16, mm -hmm. that if the first fruit is holy, mm -hmm. then the whole lamp is holy. True. And so if the first fruit is deserving of every blessing, mm -hmm. then the whole life deserves every blessing. Mm -hmm. And I think I told you that the Bible says that um, um, the scriptures also, mm -hmm. through Abraham, even the Gentiles, when they receive blessing, say that in the implication of the we are partakers of this blessing by the virtue of us being. Can I tell you why most people uh, are, are defeated by sicknesses? Mm. Because number one, they have not had enough word mm. in them. Mm. Number two, the devil makes sure they are quiet. Yeah. Because remember, it is a professed word that, mm -hmm. that, that, yeah. that, 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 that works. Mm. So the devil will make sure that you mm. <laughs> 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 uh, In just like two sentences, this, this is not going to be two sentences because there are three things. But what is what is your understanding of the difference between salvation, redemption, and justification? Ooh. 
salvation, redemption, and justification in in the simplest and in a few in a few words as we come to a close. When we say that now there is no condemnation, mm. it's because you're justified. justified. It means that no one can point out unto you a, 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 a wrong. Yeah. And justify themselves. Uh, the, the, or let me let me rephrase it and say that salvation, redemption. You you're born again. Mm. When you're born again, mm. you're redeemed. Amen. Because redeemed is being bought back. So you're bought back. Amen. Redeem is being bought back. Amen.
Oh, yo, this has been the most of best time in, 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 my, in my life so far. I'm really grateful. And even as we come to an, to an end of, of this series, Asante Sana, thank you, thank you so much for honoring us with your presence. May God bless you, may He increase you in this talk. And may, may you always be available for this work because it is a choice you make. Thank you everyone for, for watching. Thank you so much for giving your time, just clicking onto, onto this content and, and feeding off the, the, the word of God. I hope it has blessed your heart. I hope it has ministered and you. And my prayer is that the word will, will transform you. I was coming onto this platform. My prayer was that please God use, use this platform for your glory. Use this platform for your glory God and I really thank God that I get a chance to, to share and to just have guests who speak on, on, on things of God and on how we grow in the things of God so thank you so much for subscribing for liking and commenting keep commenting down below share your prayer request if you receive Jesus just comment below and leave your contact and I will get back to you thank you for watching this series I hope it has been a blessing from me to you is love so 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 much love God bless you.